Now, Kenya Railways has delayed resumption of cargo and passenger services to December this year following completion of refurbishment of rolling stock and the line between Nakuru and Kisumu. Kenya Railways Managing Director Philip Mainga says the meter gauge railway between Nakuru and Kisumu has been undergoing trials and is now ready for use pending official commissioning. The major rehabilitation works along the 216-kilometer stretch between Nakuru and Kisumu have been completed. This means that in the near future, you will now be able to make a 20-hour trip from Mombasa to Malaba after the entire loop is fully connected. Currently, we have repaired the line. I can assure you the line, the line from uh, uh, Naivasha to Nakuru, Kisumu is ready. We are preparing for operations in the next two months or three months. And that excitement goes with number one because uh, somehow we have started moving slowly some containers or some cargo across the line. Uh, people are now starting now demanding that uh, we run a passenger train. During a tour of railway facilities at the Nairobi Central Station, it emerged that some more classes will also be introduced on the passenger trains to include special sleep coaches. They are ready. We have uh, our second class ready and our first original <laughs> first class ready. You know what I mean by when I say original first class ready. Where we used to sleep, where we used to wake up, we used to wash our hands, we used to bath and enjoy the train. This is coming back. The 63-kilometer stretch between Kisumu and Butere will be operationalized with the aim of promoting trade in the agricultural rich western Kenya. At the same time, the Nairobi Transit Shed that mainly handles cargo by small businesses has so far processed 3,000 TEUs since its inception last year. We have spoken to the uh, consolidators, we have spoken to some of the traders and I, I think we want to really thank uh, the government and Kenya Railways for having uh, set up this centre, which is a game changer in terms of trade, especially for the SMEs. Our monthly estimation, where we expect to be every one month, is about 500 containers being cleared from this place. And this is basically what was happening before COVID. The SMEs would bring about 500 containers. Now, these are some of the comforts that has been missing on the Nairobi Kisumu route. Rail transport for 15 years has been missing on that particular corridor. But Kenya Railways promises Kenyans that in three months' time, they'll be able to travel seamlessly from Nairobi to Kisumu. Alan Naoko, Prime Edition.